Roughly half of the world's population lives on an income of less than $2.50 a day. For these families, a home, food, and clothes are far from a reality. Disease can be more common than the basic necessities in some developing countries. Here in the United States, children whose families can't afford to buy them shoes often go to school with soulless shoes in the hopes that no one will notice they're actually barefoot. The health and social issues associated with inadequate footwear can sometimes result in an unbroken cycle of poverty. One of the most important things is to feel, feel like you fit in. And there's children out there that outgrow their shoes. And in doing so, or wear them out, will take the bottoms off their shoes and just use the tops as foot covering so it looks like they're wearing some shoes. And that's so unfortunate. In response to this issue, certain shoe manufacturers like Skechers have adopted a gifting philosophy through their Bob's collection of shoes. Skechers will donate new shoes to children in need through the purchase of Bob's. To date, over 5 million pairs of shoes have been given to children in the U.S. and 25 countries around the world. By the end of 2013, that number is expected to be past the 6 million pair mark. I think there's so many of us that don't realize what it is to own just one pair of shoes and when we grow out of that one pair, um, what it's like not to be able to find a new pair of shoes or have to wear a pair of shoes that are too small for us, we do take that for granted. Our retail partners that we work with do feel a sense of responsibility to give back. Uh, they see the benefits um, at the store level, from the consumer level, uh, from their own employees. This gifting initiative has caught the attention of certain Hollywood celebrities. Brooke Burke Charvet is an outspoken advocate for the movement and is using her celebrity muscle to raise awareness. I'm really happy to be involved and to be able to raise awareness in such an incredible campaign that's making a huge difference in children's lives around the world. I was so surprised to learn that over 300 million children are without the simple necessity of shoes. And the way I see it, it's something we'd be doing anyway. Most of us are going to buy shoes for ourselves or buy shoes for our family. And in doing so, we're able to give a pair of shoes to a child in need, which is helping them on many levels, their self-esteem, sense of self. It's making a great difference. Um, it's just a feel-good campaign. For many of us, our shoes symbolize that we fit in with everyone else. They're a sign of confidence and worth. The same can be said for those who long for just one pair of adequate shoes. The difference they can make is astounding. As the fashion and footwear industry responds to this need, they're taking one step towards putting an end to poverty. We're building awareness. The management, the employees are out here today. Everyone's aware of our, our efforts and they're proud to be part of that. Gail Garamone is the executive director of Fashion Delivers, a nonprofit organization that partners with apparel and home furnishings manufacturers in bringing goods to those who need it the most. One of their partners is Skechers, and today they're distributing 20,000 pairs of shoes to inner city kids in Atlanta. It's Skechers' most ambitious donation to date. New shoes are among the very, very first things that all the charities we serve ask us for. They are always in demand. We are particularly proud to be partnering with Skechers because they are actually manufacturing shoes for people in need. This means that we don't have to rely on excess inventory. Skechers will get us the sizes and the range that we need. And that is a hugely important thing for Fashion Delivers and for the people that we are trying to help. We distribute the shoes not only domestically in the United States, but uh, throughout over 20 countries throughout the world. We donate shoes through schools, uh, homeless shelters, orphanages, uh, and different relief fund organizations. Uh, and it's a multiple, it's a broad range of uh, charities that we work through. For Skechers and the people involved with the Bob's Shoe Collection, it's about restoring hope and pride for those who desperately want a chance to get ahead in life. Many of us take something as simple as owning a pair of shoes for granted, but there's millions of children around the world who don't get to experience that and a program like Bob's is actually allowing us to give a tangible gift, a necessity, and we're doing that organically when we're buying ourselves a pair of shoes for our children. And as long as everybody keeps enjoying the brand and purchasing, we're gonna keep giving. We need to help people get back on their feet. And I believe that companies like Skechers know they have a corporate responsibility to give back. Consumers have a lot of choices today. They can shop wherever they want to shop and support whatever brands they want. But increasingly, they will support the brands that give back. 
and Skechers is one of them. Bob's, fun for your feet, good for your heart. To learn more, visit bobsfromskechers.com.